Active Data's Merge command allows you to combine information from two different worksheets. Here we're going to combine information from the salespeople sheet with the invoices. We're going to merge the sheet based on the salesperson column. We'll select all of the items in the invoices sheet and the name and telephone extension from the salesperson sheet. Active Data will then combine this information into a new worksheet for you. Here we can see that the salesperson information is blank. That indicates that that salesperson did not exist in the salespeople file. Here we're going to merge the invoices with the customers file. We'll select the customer number as our merge column and we'll select the desired columns from the customer sheet. Again, Active Data will combine this information and produce a new sheet for you. You can also use the merge command to compare information in different worksheets. Here we have two sheets containing a summary of the invoices for the years 2007 and 2008. We'll merge these sheets together based on the salesperson number. And we'll ask for the salesperson and count from each sheet. We want to make sure that we select the option called Rows in Sheet 2 that don't match a row in Sheet 1. This is to make sure that we get all of the salespeople from both years. Active Data will automatically tag the rows where the counts are different. Here we can see that Salesperson 24 must have been hired in 2008 since there were no invoices for 2007. We can also see that Salesperson 28 left the company at the end of 2007. Here we're going to merge the two summary sheets together again, and we're going to instruct Active Data to provide a list of differences only. Again, we'll select Salesperson as our merge column. We'll select the Salesperson and Count columns from the individual sheets and we'll check only the merge options for non-matching rows. This produces a new sheet containing a listing of the differences only.